In addition to supervisory failures, monetary policy played a role in the SVB and signature bank failures. During the COVID crisis, the Fed kept interest rates near zero. At the same time, it bought massive amounts of treasury securities and mortgage-backed securities, pumping huge amounts of deposits into the banking system. Bankers took some of these deposits and with them purchased treasury securities, long-dated treasury securities and mortgage-backed securities to gain some yield. They expected the Fed to keep interest rates low for a long period of time, according to their forward guidance. When the Fed started raising interest rates aggressively in March 2022, banks took losses on these portfolios. Not only bank, did not only banks lose money, the Fed has lost close to a trillion dollars in unrecognized losses on its securities holdings.